conversation. Um, our, there we go. Our job in healing ourselves, our inner child work, which Divya just talked about extensively, is to our being our as an adult, is to take our child by the hand, make it safe for them, get in, get them into a safe environment, and then listen to them and ask them and love them and hug them and be what they never had. Be the person, uh, I have a rock, which is really cool. It says, um, uh, it says, be the one you run to. Isn't that cool? Be the one you run to. I love that. I was like, oh, that's true. So when I get upset, I go to me. <laughs> I, isn't that cool? <laughs> I mean, it's cool. That took a lot of work because I used to need to go to other people. And now I come to me and I go, you okay? And I'm like, no, I'm not okay. <laughs> this is awful. And I go, what's the matter? And I cry or I scream or I, this, yeah, like you said. But I need to be there for me, big me. I call it another way to put it. Do you want? Oh, go ahead, Melissa. You're muted, babe. You're muted. We can't hear you. Ooh. There we go. Sorry. Um, so yeah. you were saying like like uh, that inner self, like that. I in my head, like I'm 44 years old, and I, and I in my head think. I, I'm good. I've, I've, I've dealt with all that past trauma and it's all good. Well, lo and behold, due to my current situation, I'm recognizing I have not really dealt with any of that. And uh, I do have three grandkids now and having the grandkids trying to teach them what I never experienced, what I never knew, what I like learning how to teach them to deal with their their issues their their own uh, emotions uh, you know even labeling an emotion like like I'm struggling like oh my god I realize how incapable I am of myself how the heck am I me my daughter supposed to be able to teach the grandkids something we don't understand there's no guidebook there's no manual there's you know like that's where I'm struggling because I understand I have to fix it first in order to teach them, but I don't know, like, that's why I keep seeking out people like you guys. Like, I'm like, help me. Nice, nice. I'm, I, I would, I would, if you loosen it up a little bit that you don't have to have it all figured out before you talk to them. You don't, you can, in my opinion, we can, you can do it with them, which is bizarre and also very uncomfortable, but you can go, you can feel with them. I, we have a couple granddaughters. So I've got a nine month old and a three year old that are unreal. They're so cool. And because our daughter is learned this, uh, you know, she grew up in emotional intelligent environment. And so now she's teaching her kids and it's very cool. But um, my point is that I can say to, to my granddaughter that is three years old, like, wow, that's scary for me. Or, wow, that's really, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> and I, you know, I can be real with her and I can cry with her. I did it the other day and I can just, uh, we can heal together maybe. What do you think? I, I think that's definitely, um, I think and now that you're saying it, I'm kind of reviewing some of the information with like, I, I think I have done some, some of that in brief moments oh. with, especially with my granddaughter, because she's more emotional than the boys. <laughs> but um, yeah, I think, I, I think that makes sense. Mm, cool. Cool. But, and in addition to that, like Divya is saying, we do need to do our own work. We got to do our own big work by ourselves, on ourselves. Um, it, it, we can do it by ourselves or with somebody else. It's easier with someone else, much easier. I, my wife and I have been teaching this for 30 something years and I'm like, we can do it ourselves. And she's like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't think so. But I do. I think you can. I think we can do it ourselves. Um, but it's tough. It's much, it's much easier with somebody else. Right. Divya, did you have someone like holding your hand or helping you when you started going through this stuff or do you have to all figure it out on your own? So I did a course on inner child healing. Um, but that yeah. didn't help me much. I mean, in the sense that I got to know how to go about, but I knew that I have to walk the path myself. And mm. then okay, so you took responsible. responsibility for it, but did were you alone in doing it, or did you have some help? 
No, I I I did it on my own. But you know, oh, I had yeah. important realization which I had shared with you, Matt. How I was the helicopter mother of my daughter. So I have a I have a um, I, I think she was six year old, and I realized that I don't let anybody touch her. I'm so after you know making sure that I'm her bodyguard, and then I realized that. you know how important it is to fix myself before i fix anybody melissa especially to you i'm saying because you know we can't fix anybody else the only person we can fix is ourselves so i realized if i want her to do anything i'll have to you know if i want her to be strong or independent i'll have to change bring the change in myself so i had been a, a child abuse victim i worked on it because i i was scared that i don't want elena my daughter elena to be you know to face what i faced and i became so protective about her i was very ambitious i left my job and i was just around my daughter but i knew that she will not grow properly if i am so much being the helicopter mother that i am so i changed myself for to become a better mother so last 8 years ha has been acknowledging and understanding where am i going wrong and what all so i was scared of swimming i had hydrophobia and i saw my daughter not getting into the water scared of water so i learned swimming to teach her swimming i did everything that i wanted her to do Good i did it. nice beautiful that's how it's done that's emotional responsibility that is courage that is uh we um one of the terms i like emotional intelligence terms is grit you know that term grit that's where you grit your teeth and you go this is going to be so hard and so scary and i'm going to do it anyway was, because i, I can so and i am of water. i was so scared of water i okay. can't tell you <laughs> like, okay here we go here we go this is going to suck but here we go <laughs> Woo. All right. Good job, Divya. And you know what that does for you? It uh, gives you uh self-trust, it gives you self-esteem, it gives you power, it gives you uh confidence, it gives you uh, such great stuff. If you can push through things, then you go, "Oh, I did it. I did that. I can't believe I did that. Way to go, me." I pat myself on the back. We got this thing where you put your arm out like this and you flip it over and you bend at the elbow and you give a little pat on the back and they're like, "Ah, oh, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Way to go." So, anyway. <laughs> Everything that I wanted no. her to do, I did it on myself. That you know, cool. I yeah, so because I yeah. wanted you know, get that fear, fight the fear on my own. Yeah. Yep. And you said Melissa there's no book on this blah 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 but there actually is there's a bunch of books on it now um there are and there's videos on it and there's classes on it and there's all kinds of stuff now um which is wonderful I didn't have all that stuff at it, it back then um but but now there's a great stuff and I wrote a book on it and uh Divya do you have a book I don't know Leeds got a book on it etc so we um there is there is you got to figure out what you know there's so many books now that you got to figure out what what are you trying to do let's and find a book on that <laughs> and get yeah you know cuz it's be more specific now it's so so good stuff good 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 stuff all right um all right so uh the next speaker is not for 45 minutes and so i think we are going to take a break i i would like to take a break Uh, Terry I'm sure needs to take a break. Um so if you guys yeah if you guys um want to come back you're welcome to in 45 minutes um or a little bit less than that and um and we'll keep going because Lee's up next and Lee's got some cool stuff to uh, to share with us hopefully she'll be able to connect cuz she I see she's having uh problems but all right uh Divya thank you again Melissa thanks for being involved uh adis uh thanks for being here and we will see you guys in a little bit okay or not thank but so either much, way Matt. thank Once you again a very happy birthday man please keep smiling great thank and you and lovely this meeting you melissa time. awesome meeting you all right bye bye